So what's up guys, it's Jude back with another video. So today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create this awesome thumbnail using Ender. So without wasting time, let's get straight into the video. So before getting started to this video, if you can hit the like button and subscribe, it would be awesome to see your great support. And yeah, and subscribe to the Morpho's second channel because his first channel was deleted by the YouTube. So go in the description and subscribe to the Morpho's second channel. So let's get started with the video. So first off, open Pixel Lab. And afterward, just just click on this edit and just click on edit. And now just import your text. I'll be using this thumbnail tutorial. And now just go to the second option that is A. And then just select the font. Click on this AB font. And now just select this font. The link will be given in the description to download this font. I just click on this fourth option and click on the transfer end. And now just save this image to the gallery. Now just open PS Touch. Now just click on this plus. And now just click on blank document. Click on this layers and just click on this plus and now just import your background after importing your background just click on this fx and then just click on this blur option and now just blur like this just click this plus and now just click on photo layer and now just go to a photo library and import the text that we made on pixel lab click on this end and click on this transform and now just transform it and now just select this square selection tool and now just select this part now click on this and and click on the transform transform it and click on the check mark click on this and and click on the transform and just make it smaller like that just click on the layer and just click on the plus and just click on duplicate and now just select the second layer and now click on this and and just select select pixel and now just click and and click on fill and stroke select type and now click on stroke choose the color to the black click on the width and just select this now click on check mark click on edit and click on select pixel click on and fill and stroke and now just add this add the color that you have in the background and click on check mark now again click on select pixel and click on and and click on fill and stroke and now just add black background black stroke and now again click on the select pixel and click on fill stroke just use white color and click on check mark after that just click on this click on the above layer and click on the layers and now just click on the merge down after that just click on this and and just transform it afterward just add your photo over here just like this so import this arrow image the link will be given in and import this effect the link will be given in the description to download this now just click on the layers and now just choose a blend mode to the linear dodge added or you can choose overlay i'll be using overlay and now just click on the now just go at the top layer and click on the plus and import this cc the cc pack will be given in the description to download this layers and just click on the blend mode and now choose to overlay and you can just choose the intent opacity Now just go to the image and just click on the select pixel add the stroke to it so guys if you enjoyed the video be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos thanks for watching